Hello everyone. Today in this session we will be introducing you to yum repository configuration helper lab app. The yum repository configuration helper sets up a simple yum repository for the local machine or a small number of other machines to use. If a large number of machines using Red Hat Enterprise Linux are in use or if additional flexibility or advanced features are required use Red Hat satellite. Based on your preferences the yum repository configuration helper generates a script used to set up a local yum repository and configure the machine to use it or a script to set up a http https or ftp based yum repository and repository configuration the next few steps will explain the process of accessing this lab app and enable you to get the understanding of how it works in order to access this lab visit the url as shown on the screen on the lab app page please search for yum repository configuration helper this will take you to the lab page there are two sections in this lab let's look at that one by one section 1 set up a local yum repository here you should select a specific options as per your requirement like rel version install media and ansible playbook if you want to configure the same on multiple servers using ansible once all options are selected click on generate button so that you can download the script and run as shown on the screen Now let's look at another section. Section two: Set up a HTTP, HTTPS, or FTP based YAML repository. In this section, we will use HTTP, HTTPS, or FTP protocol to share repository to multiple servers. Here you have to select specific options as per your need one by one, like you can see on the screen. Select the rail version and IP or host name of a server where you want to configure the repository. Next you will have to select the protocol you want to use and a port number from the repo server and then the path where you have kept the packages from ISO In the third step you can select the minor release of OS version product variant architecture and ISO path from where ISO will be mounted and the packages will be visible You can add multiple repositories here Going next you can select the ansible playbook option if you want to execute the ansible script over multiple servers which will create the repository enter ips and usernames of the other repo servers on which you want to run the script then review the details and proceed to generate a script here you will have two options either to run a simple bash script for local server or ansible script with provided commands on the screen We hope this information is helpful. Please do see our other videos which explains the usage process of other customer lab applications like rel upgrade helper, convert to rel, ssh vulnerabilities, etc.